What's up, guys? The Rama RX here, and we got Johto Pokemon. Oh, I'm like <laughs> way excited for this. Oh, Bulbasaur. Now I'm like, I see Bulbasaur. Oh wait, hold on. I see Bulbasaur all the time. Now I'm like, get out of here, Bulbasaur. Like I don't even need you because, man, these these Gen Two Pokemon are. Out here, they are here, boy. Let me just show you. Hold up. Right here, let me just go to recent. Now, this isn't my formal video. I'm gonna make a. I'm planning on making a formal video tomorrow, which is Saturday. If if this gets posted late, but boy, I just freaking caught a wild meganium. I've caught two, three Chikorita in this Meganium. Let's see. Hang on. I guess that would have been like three or four Chikorita. Anyway. Um, so, yeah. I just caught this Meganium. It has Vine Whip and Solar Beam. <laughs> and I've been fine. Man, look at this. I just got an Octillery. The, it doesn't have a great move move set. Water gun gunk shot. Um, I, I found a wild ride on earlier. I'm just driving around kind of by my house finding these. Um, I've got Totodile. A, a really nice Totodile at that. Uh, my first Johto was Teddy Ursa. And then I... Um, then I found like Sun Kern and Meryl and stuff. That was just me leaving my house. Well, okay. I guess my first Johto Pokemon was Togepi. But, I mean, as far as this release, the Gen 2 release, like captured in the wild, was Teddy Ursa. Um, and this is just like to get hyped because I'm so excited that <laughs> that all these, these amazing Pokemon, like... Like, Gen 2 was, like, one of my... It was my favorite uh, game of, of all time. I got uh, Pokemon Gold for Christmas one year. And then I think it was probably my birthday. Um, I don't remember when Crystal came out. I want to say it was after my birthday, which is in March. Um, I can't remember, honestly. I'll have to go. Like... But anyway, several months after I got Gold, uh, Crystal came out. I ended up getting Crystal. Um, it was like a... I don't remember if it was the day of... Or the day before. Or the... I mean the day after. It was like really soon after. And I'm pretty sure I got it the day release day. Because I got a pamphlet in the mail. Uh, with my Game Informer stuff. And it was talking about Crystal version coming out one day. And we went there that day and got it. So I'm pretty sure it was release day when we went... Uh, we went up to Best Buy. I don't know where my dude is going because that is that is not. <laughs> Come on. Let me hit. Where are you going? Oh, of course. But man, I am just I am hyped. Like, <sighs> like I'm. <laughs> I've been trying to order this camera for my drone uh, for, well, I'm going to be for sure ordering it in like about a week or two, um, and I'll probably be able to use that camera. It's just a little action camera. It's like 40 something dollars, um, but it's really good quality. It shoots 1080p, so I'm hoping um, if I if the mic is, isn't that good on it or something, I'll just be able to use the mic from this, which is fine. Um, Man, I've got Kanto Pokemon ready to go. As soon as I get those new evolutions, then I can, you know, start evolving some of those. Um, Scyther, I've got well over 100 candies. I think you only need 40 plus the metal coat uh, to evolve it. Oh, there's a Snubble boy? It's probably over here. This mall parking lot spawns all kinds of stuff. Plus, traffic is really bad right now because school just got out recently, and so we're going to be going really slow at these stoplights so I can get a little bit of dents on, on some eggs. 
Um, I'm not actually working on actually I think I only have one egg that I've received like post update be at tomorrow here let me just run through some some stuff whoops some recent captures okay so I just got this whooper this artillery wait what was that Oh, an Eevee. I need a good Eevee. Like, not that one. Because I just learned a trick to get yourself on in an Espeon. And I kept saving up candies for Gen 2 for an Espeon because I figured I was going to be like having to evolve and evolve and evolve and evolve before I finally got one of the one of the two and then I actually found out yesterday that there is a trick to it or there's a, a name trick that like you when you uh, like, like the Rainer and Sparky and um, whatever the other guy's name was Pyro and uh, so I'm gonna try that as soon as I get a good one um, pull this up I know as soon as I pull my menu up this Pokemon's gonna spawn I'm gonna have to close it out just to see what it was yeah I got this Meganium I just caught this Dunspore Spore this Dunsparce uh, but I just caught this Remoraid it was brand new I just added to the Pokedex I don't see what you're due to me over here another Eevee is that the same is that the same Eevee I don't think it is couldn't be 626 That'll work. I think my phone is lagging. Um, but yeah, I, I just got that Remoraid. And I was like, oh man, and I can start saving up for artillery candies. And then artillery spawns. I was like, what? Are you serious? I was kind of like, oh, and I just caught this ride on. I caught a ride on. <sighs> it's just crazy. I already have two ride on, and I just caught this one. Just found this in the wild. Like, what up? Murkrow, I've seen several. I can already tell which ones are going to be the. Um. um What's the word I'm looking for? The popular spawns or, or whatever around my area, around where I live. And, um, of course, everybody's going to be seeing these Centret and Hoot Hoot. Probably, probably Hopip, I guess. Maybe Murkrow. Um, but I can tell which ones are going to be real popular around my, my area. Um... Hey, gummit. Star you. Get out of here, boy. There's a gnaw too. I've seen several gnaw too. I haven't been able to catch any of them. That's what I was fixing to say with the, uh, the Merc or the Pip. I've got, got a skip loom. I, I could start saving towards jump luff candy. Of course, that. there's going to be a jump luff. Oh, whoa. These new Pokeball physics are like, like it makes the ball all the way. I don't know what is going on. This is like, I don't know if there's like a wreck or something. And he fled. I don't know if there's a, there, see, look at that. There's a skip loop. What I tell you? I know it's not a jump bluff, but. Um, yeah, the. The physics feel weird. Like it feels easier to, to throw it farther. Except I keep missing because it's like lagging on me. There. Must have been a wreck or something because a ton of people out right now. Like traffic is mega backed up. Uh, boy. I like how the Pokemon move around, like, 
they move up like to the top of the screen now and they move left and right. Boy, just get in the ball. Uh, what was that? Flower. But guys, I just wanted to make this quick video. Wow, that one was even worse than the Pokeball. That was a half decent throw. Yeah, the Pokeballs feel really light. Like it's it's really easy to just throw them this thing. of people but I just want to make this quick video and you know, it's really not like super short anymore and oh my gosh get this thing to just kind of prepare you guys and to get hyped because gen 2 is here oh my gosh this the traffic right now is horrible There's another done. What is that? Is that? <gasps> Wait, hold up. What is that? I thought that I was fixing to say, is that Aaron? But that's not Aaron because this is not Gen 3. I can't tell what that is. Oh, it's gone. What was that? Oh, I see. There was like a bad wreck or something. There's like cups way up there. I don't remember a Pokemon. Oh, <gasps> that was spill. That's what that was. Oh man, <gasps> that's my. my Hold up. Yes, yes, that is a Cyndaquil, boy. Okay, this thing better pop up. If this thing comes up, if I see this Cyndaquil. Come on. Come on, please. Anyway, I'm going to go, guys. I'm eventually going to be back at work. Oh, son why you do me like this? I wish I had a radar. I wish the stupid radar was working. That way I could find it. Because there's no Pokestops on this side of town. So there's no way to locate it via Pokestop. Other than just drive around town and freaking try to find the thing. I'm going to have to get out of this encounter. Because if Cyndaquil is right here and I miss it. Because I'm trying to catch stupid Slugma. Get out of here, boy. Oh. Pseudo. Dude, these pseudo widows come in strong. 1342? Yeah, that's like what my other one was. My first one was a little over a thousand. And then the next one was about the same. It was like 1300. These things are hard to catch. Eleven CP. And this. Nice, nice. Also, first throw bonus. If you catch a Pokemon on your first try, then you get an extra 100 points. So, yeah, that's... That's, yeah. Man, I want that Cyndaquil. Typhlosion is my all-time favorite Pokemon. Typhlosion and Tyranitar are my top two. I want that Cyndaquil so bad. Uh, Alright, I'm going to cut the video off here. If Cyndaquil pops up and I get it, then I'll start recording. But uh, if not, then I will see you guys hopefully tomorrow. Later.